we're, we're back. <laughs> Had to restart the stream, but I'm pretty sure I got it to work. Maybe we need to switch recording software. Let's watch this. So you can see how absolutely abysmal this movie is. Mark Plug Entertainment. I can just skip. <laughs> Walter, honey, hurry up. We shouldn't be late. The models for those pigs are terrifying. They look like something that I that I would make in five minutes. And I've never made a 3D model of anything in my entire life. That's saying something. Wake up, Mr. Wigglesworth! Oh. Tiffany, why can't they do this somewhere else? Crystal, oh sh... My barnyard brethren, let us reflect on our... This is nightmare fuel. What is this? It looks like just blobs of CG I've just splooged onto my computer screen. It looks awful. Blessings. I am thankful. For what, Walt? For, for everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <what>? Walter. <laughs> I, too, am thankful for everything in this blessed realm. On um, this blessed realm, until you... Until Walt it gets turned into bacon. Where each creature has his place. From the noble horse, to the small and lowly bugs. Hear, hear! What? What? These boulders aren't bugs. Uh, they're arachnids. Actually, let's see. Um, send him a link. Cause why not? Not 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 of that. Of my stream. So I get someone to do this with me. Uh, this is my stream. So I get someone to do this with me. Uh, this is my stream. So I get someone to do this with me. Let's see. Uh, this is my stream. So I get someone. Alright, now that's done. All right, let's continue. Let it go, girl. Who's he calling, Lola? <coughs> I give thanks. Oh. I give thanks that all creatures. <laughs> that horse. <laughs> that. Wait. Uh, back. <coughs> I give thanks. That horse is me. I'm like, oh, what, uh, what have I got myself into? Oh. I give thanks that all creatures are cherished equally from the small and agile spiders who keep the world spinning to the big plodding horses who produce nothing but manure <laughs> that produce nothing but diarrhea <laughs> in in anus this liquid anus <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tiffany, that is cold! I see, <laughs> oh, really. How very cruel. I, I am thankful. Why is the bee French? Why is the bee French? <laughs> <laughs> that we put in the common good above our own petty struggles. Here, here. Amen. Nice words, Walt! Thanks, Penny. Say nice flying earlier. Flying? <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to mention Walt is a lying bastard. 
And that and that would basically become a main theme throughout this movie. This it is just a little FYI. Oh Walt, I can't fly! No, I saw you soaring high above the barn. The diet must be working. <laughs> oh Walt! <laughs> Walt, honey, Penny can't fly over the barn. Don't stretch the truth. Hello, Walt. Good breakfast. Again, why if the beef French <laughs> French bees? <laughs> Whatever. Mm. How's it going, Gilbert? Instead of nectar, this f the French bees <laughs> use uh, wine to make honey. <laughs> Why? Wine, honey. <laughs> I'm not well. I've tried pollinating petunias, pansies, even peonies. It's just not working. So, don't pollinate and say you're dead. Huh? Gilbert, you're a bee, right? Yes, of course. Bees are supposed to pollinate. But guess what? No one cares. Just fly around the flowers and fake it. That's not right. Gilbert, just tell folks what they want to hear. Nope. I never lie. Hi there. <laughs> Hello. Say, pal. Didn't I see you buzzing around the lilacs earlier? <laughs> Probably. What's up with that? You act like a bee. I am a bee. No, you're a wasp. Like me. I am not a wasp. Wasps are dirty and selfish. Whoa, buddy. The nectar has gone to your head. Why would you want to... I don't even know anymore. W what the hell? Are we watching? <laughs> also, my favorite part of this is that in the recommendation, the Sesame Street movie. <laughs> this. <laughs> oh God, no! <laughs> Back to this <laughs> full screen because <laughs> so that we don't see the death coming. Be a bee anyway. Shoo, shoo. Ugh. Later, pal. Gilbert, why are you hanging out with that hedonist? He just flew over. I did not invite him. Of course not. But be careful. We wouldn't want rumors starting. No, no. There's nothing wrong with us. Oh, really, Tiffany? <laughs> this, this horse again is me. <laughs> I am... <j> <laughs> I don't even know how to describe it. <laughs> You'll say anything. Hey, if Gil wants to be a bee, let him be! <laughs> Puns. This, this movie is melting my brain. That's bad, Crystal. <laughs> let the bee be! <laughs> <sighs> Most unseemly. My pie! This bitch had his picked pie! The sausage pie. The sausage pie has, go has gone. Who ate it? <sighs> Walt, what happened to my pie? What pie? The pie I baked last night and put in the cage next to my favorite pot. Why didn't? <laughs> Why would you put a pie in a cage next to your favorite piece of pottery? Well, pigs aren't exactly the smartest, so I guess. How should I know, Walt? You saw me bring it out. Please be honest, Mom. Walter, honey, what's come over you? Why won't you tell the truth? The lying bastard strikes again. Okay, fine. You want the truth? Mom, I almost gave my life protecting the pie. Ah! <laughs> the animation is awful. Uh, <sighs> that duck face is everyone when they see this gigantic piece of doo-doo. Here's what happened. 
Beneath falling leaves, the pie was vulnerable to pie-loving thieves. From out of the sky, UFOs from out. Is this pig trying to rap? <laughs> please don't melt my brain. Like it's already melting, but please do not speed it up. I need the sanity to make it to make it through the stream. Outer space flew to see the pie. The aliens thought that pie's an enemy ship. They became distraught. Oh, <laughs> that fire is probably nerf darts. <laughs> also, these uh, UFOs are copy and paste. It was not pretty. There was cherry pie go everywhere. That looked like blood. How do you know it was a cherry pie? Huh? Ch a cherry pie? He brought. If this was real. It probably not because the lying bastard is striking again. <laughs> it was probably just blown the bits. No, basically it turned inside out by the nerf darts. <laughs> That's how he knew. <laughs> well, I, you, you must have told me. Expo. <laughs> I don't even know. No. Ah! Grab your chicks and run for your lives! Penny, let your chicks be. I'll tell you what happened to the pie. The pie disappeared into Walt's hungry stomach, just as Esther feared. What a great imagination, Tiffany. An imagination. Mm. I don't even know. Wait, how? Oh, uh, wait, how much more do we have to go? 40? We're 5 minutes 20, 523. And the minute's 40 minutes long. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm probably going to lose my sanity by the 20 minute mark. So, hey, I could probably make this a two parter. Uh, um, so, we are presented with two conflicting versions of what happened. One provided by Walter Pembroke III, a pedigreed pig. The other concocted by Tiffany, a spider. <laughs> hmm. 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 Also, horse, if you make the fun of that spider enough, It'll probably bite you and then kill you to death. <laughs> and then poison you to death with its venom. Or maybe it's just a harmless spider. Let's not dignify the latter with a response, shall we? Oh, let it go, girl! Still, some aspects of Walt's story are troubling. Why was the cage undisturbed? And would not alien lasers leave blast marks on the pie tin? Moreover, when an extraterrestrial arrives on Earth, he or she will, no doubt, choose to make contact with the most advanced life form. The horse! Certainly, but specifically, a member of the Wigglesworth family. Of course, how right you are. So if it was not... Okay then. This horse is spitting straight facts. Literally. UFOs, what did Walt see? A weather balloon, perhaps? You think a balloon ate the pie? Tiffany, please. We are engaged in a serious investigation. A serious investigation and a move... And a movie made, probably made by a guy in his base, a basement while drunk. Perhaps Walt saw a reflection of moonlight. Balloons? The moon? Wigglesworth, you are really tripping! The fat little pig ate the pie! End of story! Tiffany, Crystal, the Pembrokes have been leading members of our community for generations. Whereas I didn't notice your names in the barnyard social registry. <laughs> <laughs> Spiders First of all, what am I even looking at? 
Like, we've been looking at this for a bit. I'm just... What I'm looking at is a molding, heaping blob of CG. But... But why does it look like a spider web is as thick as a pipe cleaner? This is very unrealistic. <laughs> and the spiders are... And the spiders are probably nice. Are probably just hanging on normal strings. <laughs> long before you and your pretentious pals arrived. Yeah, I will be here long after you're dead and gone. That's right. <sighs> I don't even know. Such impudence. It's really too much. Walter, aliens did not eat the pie. Honey, please just tell the truth. That has to be probably has been one of the most awkward walk cycles I've ever seen in, in cinema history. Whew. That was close. Tiffany, you've got to stop squealing on me! Well, He's just calling... Uh, Tiffany is just calling bullshit where you see bullshit. <laughs> and it just happens that you're... That in spite of being a pig, you're an excellent source of bullshit. Stop lying! Everyone knows you ate the pie! No? Oh, Walt, you and I go way back. When your mean brother Willby tried to push you out of the pen, who saved you, Bacon? You did, Tiffany. When that crazy Wigglesworth tried to teach you to waltz, who had him hog-tied? You again, Tiffany. Walt, honey, Tiffany's worried about her baby. I know life is tough, but telling tall tales is not the answer. Stretching the truth sometimes helps keep everyone happy. Uh-uh, lying does not pay, sweet pie. Of course, one good reason is... Um, Oh, why bother? What, Tiffany? Well, there's a really good reason never to lie. But I'm not going to tell you until you're ready to listen. <sighs> Tip. Tip. <laughs> Alright, the spider is making some pretty decent points so far. I guess. The pig is basically just... Uh, probably just doing Kent Hovind's level of... Of ignorance. Intentional ignorance, by the way. Tiffany, I wish my life were as easy as yours. What? Oh, no, 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 no. The pig did not say Tiffany has an easy life. It did. I have... It did. It's like the movie is self-aware. Is that every single thing... It's just a moly, it's just a, a, a normal pig. It's just, it's like the movie is self-aware that its models look like the thing it's trying to represent if it, if it did a lot of marijuana. Don't do drugs, kids. Of all this pressure. Oh, please. You get free food, free lodging. Everyone loves Walter Pembroke. The third. Walt says, I'm thankful for, for everything. And everybody laughs. Oh, Walt. <laughs> You're treated like a prince. Mm-hmm. That's why they call him the other white meat. <sighs> Life's not easy for anyone. <gasps> oh, a snake. Snake. With a, with a sex color. We're nine minutes in this, and I'm pretty sure the stream. Wait, how long does the stream? Let me check. 19 minutes! Okay. Huh? A rattlesnake! No, it's just a snake with a sex color. Wait, that's not a sex caller, that's a phone caller. Hey. Huh? As Ava Sparks said, maybe it's both. Oh, <laughs> mine. <laughs> Hello? Hello? You have one new message. Well, so. 
you have one new message. Yeah. And he just closes the phone. <laughs> oh, hi, I'm Norman Gerard. Norman Gerard? It just did down on some biz. Anywho, Walt is it? A nice job saving the Earth from UFOs. Yo, Snake, that's not what happened. There were no UFOs. Really? Then why are there so many alien mystery specials on TV? Because most of those alien mystery specials are, are for stupid people at a watch while extremely high on marijuana. Continue on. Yeah, smarty pants. Spiders. They got four eyes, but they just can't see. Spiders actually have eight eyes. But just in case you and never knew that spiders could be more terrifying. Here we are. Ja, whatever, just dosh up. Now, Walt, go tell your mother that you ate the pie. But I... I she gets mad and... Stick with the flying saucer story, Walty. It totally works. It does, eh? Walter! Forget about the pig, girl! He's a born liar! Walt, please! Tiffany! <gasps> what was that? <gasps> Oh, Walt, you broke my favorite pot. I did not. He, he the was he's about to say he did not, <laughs> but he, even though he just did, right in front of her. Not if you didn't break the pot, who did? Who? You mean what? What? I'm still shaking. Per I'm still shaking. What? I don't even know. I'm probably... Oh, wait. The lying bastard is going to strike again. This time it's harder than ever. Protecting your pot, Mom, almost cost me my life. <gasps> Thick fog rolled in, enveloping the barnyard, hunting did begin. Emerging alone, a ghostly phantom spirit. What? I am confused. Both up from his throne. The his throne is apparently a recliner. Eerie form stopped. Tiffany jumped and scared him. He ran, the pot dropped. Oh no no, that's not what happened. Walt knocked the pot over. Mm-hmm, the pig did it! Yet again, Tiffany forces us to spend valuable time refuting her spidery version of events. Most unseemly. Oh. Did a Ghosts destroy Esther's pot? Do ghosts even exist? Perhaps, but there is little concrete evidence. So what explains what Walt saw? A clumsy pig! That explains it! <clears throat> yeah. This horse. I'm starting to like him less and less and less. The more this movie goes on. And... But that, but that's pro, um, pro, that, but that could also be my sanity slowly, um, a drizz, a drizzling out of my ears. Is there something of this world that could waft through the air and cause us all to become dizzy and black out? Drugs. I submit there is methane gas. Huh? Emitted by cows. Methane gas emitted by cows? You mean farting? Oh. Wigglesworth, don't- You mean farting? Oh. Yes. Yes, farts. Farts infused with, with a, a vaporized mess. <laughs> Tell me you think Esther's pot was destroyed by farting cows? I submit that a sudden eruption of methane gas might have caused wide-ranging wooziness, and one of us may have unconsciously knocked the pot over. Uh, I... I believe in ghosts. Why, Penny? 
I see dead chickens. <laughs> Walter, we'll talk about the pot later. Right now, come inside and let me check your homework. Oh, um. Homework. The lying bastard is about to strike once again. <laughs> like four seconds after he, he struck. Um, uh, honey. <laughs> it's, it's like that one scene from JoJo. And he was is repeatedly punching his foe. What? As if his fists were gatling guns. <laughs> Please tell me you did your homework. The answer is yes. But after I did my homework, did the dog eat it? <laughs> no, the dog didn't eat my homework. The homework, it ate the dog. Ah! Ow! The homework ate the dog. <laughs> this book is it nightmare fuel. Look at it. It looks like it it's going to jump out of your ne worst nightmares and slit your throat. <laughs> uh, no, it's not a nightmare. It looks more like a sleep paralysis demon if you did a ton of meth. <laughs> Look at its eyes. It just wants to die because it knows what's coming. We're 12 minutes in and it's... It's the video itself. It's 26 minutes. Stream itself 26 minutes. Well, this <laughs> this this homework book looks half as as hell. No! Math homework is tough. Long division, subtraction, those fractions are rough. When I finished primes, Spot and I played some ping pong. I beat Spot three times. I like ping pong too, the homework said with a grin. Spot said, go, shoot. It did not take long. The homework ate Spot quickly. Now I hate ping pong. I always hated homework. Me too. Tiffany, do you wish to comment? What? Oh no, I'm not going to respond to that nonsense. <laughs> Penny, what's wrong? <laughs> That's what happened to Henry. <laughs> Your cousin Henry? He was an excellent student. <laughs> then one day he just disappeared. The homework must have eaten Henry. <laughs> Penny, the homework did not eat Henry. The farmer did. Huh? Facts. Haven't you noticed that your relatives all go missing on Sundays around dinner time? Huh? <coughs> that screaming duck is me internally. I'm just internally screaming inside. It's from the shittiness of this movie. We're 13 minutes into the movie. <laughs> I've already made like 40,000 comments. Walt, I worry about your future. But Mom! <sighs> like your mother, Walt, I too worry about your future. You lying bastard. Too. Around here, that is. Your talents are wasted on these barnyard yokels. But they're my friends. Yes, yes, I love them as much as you. <laughs> but. But. <laughs> that pig just looks absolutely as fuck. <laughs> but there is a place where you would make better friends. Where? Viperwood. Viperwood. Viperwood? Oh no! Hold on, Slim! I can't go to Viperwood! I've never left the barnyard! So leave! I've got a car! Walt's got no money! I've got cash and credit cards! I'll take care of everything! Cash and credit cards, they probably stole! 
<laughs> Why did the French be the French be just fly over and made his own comments? <laughs> Wait, go Cash back. And credit cards. I'll take care of everything. <laughs> <laughs> the French be just flies over for no reason. If he doesn't add anything, <laughs> whatever. Now I've got a question at this point. <laughs> I don't know. We can come back whenever you want, Walt. If you ever say, back to the barnyard, I'll rush you right home. Tiffany, why don't you come along? Oh, yes, please, Tiffany. You could keep me out of trouble. I don't know. I'm in. What's going on? Mom, we're going to Viperwood. Viperwood? Honey, that's awfully far. Tiffany is going to chaperone. Oh, well, if Tiffany is going... What? Tiffany, please. Uh, sure, I'm going. And I'll look after Walt, I promise. Well, then, have a good journey. Mom. <laughs> Be careful, honey. So, what's basically happening is that the, uh, that the snake is driving the, uh, the, the pig, the, the main character, to, to a place called Viperwood. It's basically Hollywood, but for, but snack. And Tiffany is going with, and the mom is kind of just mom pig is kind of just letting all this all happen for some reason. Yeah. All right, let's continue. <laughs> Horrible backgrounds. Also, that model scares me. The bee is going because why not? <laughs> They're just reusing the same assets from another movie made by the made by the same people as Cars Life. It's equally shitty, <laughs> and the car model is the same goddamn car from that movie. I might even, I'm not questioning it. I'm just I'm just pointing that out. It's a, it's time to, I don't know what time it is, what time is it, wait time, what time is it, 9.18pm at Central Time. Calm down Lucy, it's dinner time! No! <laughs> Car. Welcome to the Two Star Motel. Pretty swank, huh? I'll say. Get used to living in luxury, Walt. The Two Star Hotel. <laughs> because the pig is used to. Uh huh, the pig is used to a living in a one and a half star. You know, in a one and a half star house. A two-star hotel is a massive upgrade. Ha uh ha. -huh. I'm totally laughing because it's funny and not laughing because I'm slowly losing my sanity. <laughs> Are we there? <laughs> yet. Tiffany, look! The two-star motel! Uh-huh. Jara, you've got to slow down and stop driving like a maniac! <laughs> Where did this fool snake learn to drive? Wow, I almost had lost you! Gilbert, most bees like to hang out in the hive with the queen! Why are you coming with us? That seems unbe-like! Pig. Calm down, Lucy! No! <laughs> Why did they use the, reuse the same scene? It's the same goddamn scene. With a slightly different voice line. Oh, excuse me. My granddaughter Lucy is stuck on the roof. Could you folks help get her down? Yeah, we're gonna lie her to death. <laughs> I 
I'm gonna tell her that your earth is flat. <laughs> no, not a chance, lady. What was that? Huh, she's hard of hearing. The kid says she likes it up there. Really? Lucy was always terrified of heights. <laughs> yep, call it relying her to death. <laughs> Let my suffering continue, I guess. Nope, she's in kitty heaven up there. Let's go. The poor little thing looks scared to death. Not our problemo, Waldo. Walt, get ready to catch her. Come down, Lucy. Walt, come on. You're on your way to the top. You can't waste time on the little people. Poor little dear. Come down, come down. No. <laughs> get off this roof. <laughs> It'll be okay. Lucy, ah! <sighs> I'm just wondering, what the what the hell are these models? It's just an egg with another egg attached to it with this silly putty with t with two paper clips for arms. <laughs> Thank you so much! Thank goodness Lucy is alright! Gerard, what you did was terrible. You have to treat others with kindness and respect. Yeah. Maybe this trip was a bad idea. No, no, Walt. You are absolutely right. One must be kind and respectful. Lucy. Mm, let's make nicey. Kids today, they have no manners. I. They have no manners when they're talk. What if I was talking to someone like, like this, this viper, like this vo like this viper with a sex collar? Then I would probably be a bitch too. Blame video games. That's what you'll become if you keep lying, Walt. Mhm. Mm the snake has no soul, and neither will the pig. <laughs> Thank you so so much. <laughs> Check us on line seven. I was afraid I'd have to sleep in my car. And this one above lines ten and twelve. I I am so grateful. There are tissues in the restroom. Next. One room for one night, please. Cash or credit card. <sighs> We're awfully tired. Perhaps we could settle in the morning. First thing. Well then, Viper card. <laughs> the card's rejected. <laughs> there must be some mistake. You got cash? <sighs> there must be something wrong with, with your machine. Next. I have a reservation, Dr. Pretentious. Those credit card machines are so unreliable. Uh-huh. Walt, Jara's got no morals and no money. Let's go home. In spite of the fact that I have been silent for like a two, like three minutes, I have been, for that time, I've been, just been mentally screaming. And also because this part is fairly redundant. We're almost in Viperwood. You're almost a star. A star? Tiffany, we can't give up now. A ball of fucking plasma. Tiffany, you're almost a ball of fucking plasma. Oh, sometimes you've got to cut your losses. <sighs> Let's talk about this in the morning. Maybe we can stay at Lucy's. Great idea. We'll tell the old bag that we were attacked and robbed, and then we- We'll tell her the truth. We need a place to spend the night. Good idea. This viper's a bitch.
Death that also has to be the most awkward walk cycle I've ever seen. Unless you're literally just a pause. <laughs> the deep deep as someone <laughs> smashed their face against it. This is how bad it is. I never knew that a pig can knock at the door. Wait, how long has this stream been going on for? Forty minutes. Hi. Hi! Thanks again for helping. Hey! <laughs> Thanks. Tanks. Next. <laughs> I am. I am not laughing because my jokes are funny. I am laughing because I'm going insane. Thank God we're almost on the halfway mark. We'll see. Our pleasure. Um, ma'am, we kind of need a place to stay tonight and- Stay here! Come in! Thank you. That's very kind. You got cable? Huh? Cable TV? No. So this is your room? Thank you. That's very kind. How do you turn this on? No! Don't turn that TV on! <laughs> of course. <laughs> <laughs> good! Well then, good night! Good night. I thought she'd never leave. Gerard, we promise not to turn the TV on! We're... We're... Imagine just the TV turned on and just makes a soda can noise. That would be the most random thing that would happen, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's probably gonna happen, isn't it? Relax, she's deaf. She said not to! She'll never know. So come to Linkstown for the best sausages. What's he talking about? It's a so bad. Welcome back. This is the final round where the stakes are paddle wackier. Your category, metrics. In what country was the metric system invented? Um... Time is running out. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> out. <laughs> what the hell am I even watching? I know what I'm watching. It. Fucking piece of shit. But what is this? A game show where if you get a question wrong or say I don't know, you get fucking spanked by a paddle with a fly wing. What? Oh, oh, oh. Paddle whack! Paddle whack! Paddle whack! Paddle whack! Paddle whack! Paddle whack. A doodle smack. <laughs> the system was invented in France. Blame the French. Yeah. Hey, what's going on? This is the best part. Just turn it off. <laughs> I fucking called it. <laughs> And made a soda can noise. In fact, I think I can replicate it. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Why does it make a soda can noise when, when you try to turn it off? It's just, that's like, like, did you break something? <laughs> <sighs> this movie. It's making me go insane. Ouch! Hey! <laughs> the TV! Uh, calm down, honey! Gilbert, show your stinger! I cannot sting it! I would die! Ah, my foot! The house is collapsing! This place is a madhouse! Let's go! No, Gerard, we
We've caused this mess. We can't leave. Yes, we can. Oh, uh, grab the TV. What? I can fix it. Gerard, stealing is wrong. <sighs> you and your barnyard hang-ups. Come on. Well, yeah, all right. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. The TV just gained sentience and everyone's like, fuck this shit, I'm out. <laughs> Wait, this trip to Viperwood is a bad idea. Mm-hmm, that snake is bad news. I don't want to end up just another pig killing time until retirement. This may be my one chance. <sighs> my spider senses are tingling. Did you see? Oh. I don't even know anymore. Thank God we're at the halfway mark. Well, well, a little bit under. Like we're about to get the get to the halfway mark. And not in a good way. Ooh. What an unfriendly place. They don't trust anybody. <clears throat> oh, for heaven's sake. We really need gas. Pay before you pump, pal. Cash or credit? What an annoying question. One second. Walt, fill her up. What? No, we haven't paid. I'm going to pay. Walt, stop assuming the whole world is like your barnyard lava land. Life is tough. Do you want to succeed? Well, yeah. Then pump. Well, life is tough. But lying through it is not exactly the best thing to do. 23 minute mark. I, I'm At this rate, I think I'll end up in insane asylum. A credit, sir. <laughs> My Viper card. Walt, put that hose back. Tiffany, shh. You will get caught and end up in jail. This card's no good. Got cash? What was that? <laughs> Libra, Virgo, we got another pump and run. Pump and run. And now they're sending out isopods with on scooters. They're probably going to gun them down. <laughs> Tiffany, what do we do? You should have thought of that before stealing gas. Tiffany! Don't worry, Walt. I'll outrun them. <laughs> yep, they're yep, they're gunning them down. But instead of firing bullets, they're firing fucking mini nukes. Whoa! Uh-oh. Ah! Sting them! I cannot! I want to see Zapperwood before I die! They're trying to kill us! Just because the snake stole some gas, that's not right! Boo! <laughs> Yay, Tiffany! <laughs> That car, the motion that this car is doing. Whoa! <laughs> the motion that that car was doing was not was not healthy. Don't blow, Walt. Wow. Actually, wait a minute, I gotta take a piss.
All right, we're back. <laughs> and just as sad as ever. Oh, nice, huh? This place is too sunny. Put up the top. No can do. It's Viperwood, baby. Viperwood. Fucking Viperwood. We drive to be seen. Fucking hot boss. Where the fuck did that snack come from? <laughs> ah! Venom, I've missed you like a phantom limb. <laughs> <laughs> Is this the amazing Walt? <laughs> Hi, Walt. Yeah. Walt, pretty. I'm pretty sure Walt knows exactly what's coming. And it's not good. Everyone is talking about you! Everyone? I told you, Walt. Venom, uh, what's our first appointment? We've got an audition at the Broadway Theater! Walt doesn't do auditions, Venom. Oh, right! Of course! <laughs> Oops! You got the part! Really? Absolutely! They just need you for a, a wardrobe fitting. Ah, the magic of live theater. The Cleek lights. The adoration of adoring fans. Ah, 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 it's burning me! Ah. <sighs> Next. Ah, ah, make it stop! Send the others home. Walter Pembroke has arrived. Oh, I've looked so forward to meeting with you. <laughs> really? <laughs> I hate this. Wait, how long has this stream been going on? Fifty two minutes. Fifty two minutes. And I'm losing my goddamn sanity. Your resume, very impressive. I need a show stopping act, and you might be it. <laughs> Gee. So, you can hold your breath underwater for 20 minutes? Wow. What? No, I hate water. <laughs> oh, Walt is practically an aquatic mammal. Pig. Huh? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> One sec. You get ready. Gerard, what's going on? You're becoming a star. Hold on. Yeah. Time out, Snake. Walt is talented, but he can't do what you promised. Details. Minor details. I'm back. We ready? Almost. <laughs> what's going on? <laughs> Hit it. <laughs> Don't fly, but bitch, dude's fly. Fishy, fishy, fishy's in the bright blue sky. Uh, it's kinda hard to understand the pig. He's just warming up. Enunciate, Walt. Fishy, fishy, fishy's in the bright... I hate this. Actually. Alright, let's continue. Look at this! Oh, oh, ow, ow! What the fuck did that? What the fuck did Walt use to make to, to make that goldfish fucking bite bite that pig's ear? Get this fish's fish away! I cannot watch! Uh, not sure the pig is working for me. He does for me. One sec. This is your pig. I... I have nothing to say. I have absolutely nothing to say. What is this? Look at this. This could literally be a meme template. In fact, this entire movie is probably a meme. But for the sake of a, but for the sake of a live stream, I'm. 
I'm having to do this. Right now, I'm pretty sure drowning in fish pool is a, a, a perfect, my preferred alternative to this. But instead, I'm watching this on a fucking Saturday. Just dissolving my brain cells. Alright, let's continue. And you're blowing it. I can't breathe. Yeah. Oh. Then don't breathe. Yo, fish! Stay away from my friend, okay? Oh, thanks, Tiffany. It won't rhyme to swim right by. <gasps> <sighs> next next fucking ne next the toy I want to do what the toy next really <laughs> but no I'm staring at this thing <laughs> on a on my Saturday night guy gotta hit this That was horrifying. Ah, forget it. Live theater is a terrible business. The only stakes making money are those greedy theater owners. What? You said live theater is magical. Now it's the worst business ever? Well, that's what, hap that's what ha happens when you're a lying bastard. You fucking contradict yourself left, and left, right, and center. Uh-huh. The snake just lies and lies. What happened back and at- Lies and 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 fucking lies and then get sent to jail for that. and then get sent to jail for because of how many lies you've told. The theater was embarrassing for everyone. It was. Oh my dad, El Shing! Let's go home while you still have a shred of dignity. It was awful, and it won't happen again. No, it won't. I could end this stream while I still have a shred of dignity. If I had that shred of dignity. <sighs> okay, Gerard, back to the barnyard. Come again? You said if I said back to the barnyard, you would drive us all right home. Hmm. I don't recall that conversation. Bullshit. <laughs> uh, what was I wearing at the time? You weren't wearing anything, except that fool cell phone. Still drawing a blank. Oh, we're stuck here. Walt, everything is going so well. Yes, yes. There's a whole world waiting to buy. The pig with charisma. Charisma. Oh, Walt, you really want to be famous. Yes, I do. Oh, fine. Let's try again. But honestly, no more lying. Okay. Huh? Sex, sex call. Neurological activation. Oh, <laughs> hello. Yes. Yes, we'll be right there. Walt's going to be a TV star. Neuron activation. Are we back? I accidentally unplugged my headset. Neat. Alright, we'll get back. Alright, we're good. Ah, the magic of television. That warm, glowing screen that binds us all together. And also tears us apart in some situations. Like now. You always don't 
watch a particular TV show anymore. They just flip through channels until something grabs them. That's why we need explosions, violence. Be ahead. But I want to offer something educational. Huh? I want viewers to learn something. Then you come to the wrong fucking place, dumbass. Try YouTube for once. I'm pretty sure YouTube existed. Yeah, YouTube was a thing when this movie came out. It was still in its very primitive early stages. But it was a thing. You could upload a video. You could have uploaded educational videos onto YouTube, but it's but instead you're making a TV a channel. Because I don't know I don't know, because this universe fucking hates me. Oh, this snake's going to be out of a job soon. I am so pleased to meet you, Walt. A pig with substance. <laughs> a pig with a pig with substance. That substance being bullshit. <laughs> I see you graduated from Chops University. Huh? No. Magna cum porter. And you run marathons. I'm not. Whoosh. What exactly are you planning for, Walt? <laughs> What a charming spider! Walt is appearing on Paddle Wackier! Paddle? A paddle fappier. It's... I don't even know what to say anymore. We're 30 minutes in in a 40 minute long movie. How long has this stream been? An hour and one... An hour and two minutes. I fucking hate this. I'm just suffering. Uh, wait, I, I think I have a Discord notification. What? <laughs> Alright, we're... I got that handled. Alright, let's continue. The quiz show where contestants get spanked. Let's go, Walt. We allow a friend to help out. Me? Help? On TV? <laughs> you were- Paddle Hacker. The show where you get spanked. Uh, uh, for every single response, it's time for the right fucking answer. Even if the response is shooting yourself in the fucking head and then, <laughs> and then having her, uh, your help move through you, just, I yeet you into the wall. For TV! <laughs> I'm just wondering, where, uh, where was... Where is the audio from the from the crowd noise it's coming from? Just wondering. Places, everyone. Good luck, Walt. You too, Tiffany. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Let's face Paddle Wackier. Tonight, Walter Pembroke the third. The category, Colors! Mm. When you mix yellow and blue, what color do you get? Oh, pigs are colorblind. <laughs> pig. Pig. Pig, pig, pig. Pig, pig, pig. Are, don't, are colorblind. Pig. <laughs> Uh-oh, don't worry, baby. Walt is requesting his helping friend. No, 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 no,
Yellow and blue, mate. Green. Green. Correct. <laughs> Next is an octopus brown, yellow, pink, or green. More colors, Tiffany. I don't know. Just say anything and smile. You're on TV. What? Just say anything and smile. You're on TV. That's basically the. Uh, that's basically the news channel for you. <laughs> Hard hitting political jokes are funny. Color is an octopus. Walt. That ver that actually varies. Uh, the usual color for your typical octopus is actually fuck it, all of them. The truth you don't know. Make something up. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> it's too much pressure. Just run away. The truth, Walt. Any color, Walt. I don't know. <laughs> it's a trick question. Octopi Ow! can change Ow! color, so they can be brown, yellow, Ow! pink, or green, or Ow! other colors too. <laughs> you sadistic fuck. Uh, I could have said any color. Yes. <laughs> oh. My butt really hurts. That paddle is vicious. Yeah. Okay, how do I turn this into a sex joke? Well, television is a terrible business. Just a vast wasteland of mindless schlock. I thought you liked TV. Venom. As the bullshit chain keeps going, you forget everything. <laughs> we. That wasn't five seconds ago. Tell the spider I'm not talking to it. Uh, Tiffany, if you'd let Walt answer the question, he'd be a star right now. Walt told the truth. Yeah, and all he got was a sore behind. Tiffany, your tired old morals have no place in this town. Being honest is important, no matter where you are. Oh, please, go back to the barnyard. Maybe I will. You want me to go too, huh, Walt? I, I didn't say that. You didn't have to. Tiffany, I just... My butt hurts. So does my... So does mine too. But look at me. I'm making myself suffer for... Uh, for other people's amusement. <laughs> and that's what you used to think. <laughs> oh, and that is cold. What was that? Cold. Did a car hit us? I'll sue. <gasps> Earthquake. Oh, <laughs> my phone. Hello. What? Yes. 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 <gasps> yes. 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 <laughs> Walt, my boy, you're going to be a movie star. <gasps> Yay! Uh, this bitch is a... Uh, this, this sus. It's already a movie star, but... But the movie isn't self-aware enough to even realize that. We're like 34 minutes into this. And we're... Actually, I'm completely lost. I'm just, I'm just going with it. Why not? The magic of the movies. Alone in the dark. Oh, ouch! Jara, you've got to learn to drive. Tiffany, I'm going to be in a movie. What kind of movie? It's uh, an action film. An action movie. Where everyone... Actually, <laughs> I know what I make a movie. Of this, of this viper. He's gonna get shot in the fucking head. <laughs> I'm nervous. That's normal, baby. Just be honest and real. If it's meant to be, it's meant to be. Yeah. 
Walt. I see you're an Olympic gymnast, a black belt in karate, and a world-class swordsman. And you speak Japanese. Huh? Which is important because the director does not speak English. Walt, you got the part. <laughs> That's basically me, but if the clip was in reverse. Here's the deal with Japanese. You speak Japanese? Fluently. Oh, the wild nights I spent slithering through the back streets of Tokyo looking for a good shiatsu massage. Uh-huh. Oh, I have such a bad feeling about this. So... Me too. Look at me. I'm, I'm making myself suffer. Japanese has two phonetic alphabets, plus 2,000 Chinese characters, all of which have multiple readings. Wow, sounds really hard. It is, if you bother to learn it, but there's no need. When Murakami speaks, just bow and say hi. Hi? Hi means yes. You won't! Hi means yes. I know that. The clueless pig to pretend to speak Japanese? That's your solution? Exactly. The to pretend to speak Japanese. How far are we in this movie? 35 minutes, 14 seconds out of 48 minutes, 10 seconds? God, I want to die. Japanese are extremely polite. They won't want to embarrass the star. The star? This is gonna be interesting. Ooh, no, it's not. This is so exciting. Jimmy, they came out this, Dodix. This is so exciting. As says, as says the blind deaf hobo on, on the street corner. Hi. Yeah, you're welcome. Hi, hi. Gerard, you are so right. All I have to. Say it's time that we now explode. It's time we explode in eight. Seriously, that's part of the movie. FYI. Hey, and everything is fine. Walt, we haven't even started shooting. Good luck. Hi! <laughs> I like how they got someone who actually speaks Japanese. I'm just gonna. Action! Walt! Uncle! Piggy got knife. He got a knife. Versus Lobos. Take that! And that! Take that! I just need a moment to process what is happening. I just need a moment. The only thing that my brain is picking up is my... Is my... Is my masochism meter... Is my masochism meter uh, uh, being almost max. Alright, so get Shrap, shrap. Come on, watch. Ouch. Hey, do it. Hey. Okay then. I don't even know. Thirty-six minutes. Twelve more minutes of this stupid fucking shit. Uh oh, Tiffany. Alright. My well, guess is that we're is that if we are about to explode in it and killing killing all of us immediately. Just just so that we can have an end to this fucking satanic madness. Or not. Or not and the pig and the and the pig will just explode instead of us. Go! Yo! 
like a real explosion it just it just looks like the, uh, this part right here like this part right here just gone fire <laughs> well even a real fucking explosion but damn that fire has some fucking knockback because you were just flung to the stratosphere oh give me one oh me <laughs> no, no, the acting thing didn't work out. Whoops, he's awake. Gotta go. Walt! What happened? Movies are... You might not be able to notice, but... He has a cast that's the same color as his skin. So... It just looks like he has a tumor. In fact, that's Lauren. That's canon now. He has a tumor. He he now has cancer. <laughs> he now has arm cancer. <laughs> All predictable formulaic schlock. A terrible business. We're at Tiffany, Crystal, and Gilbert. Sightseeing! The doctor suggested bed rest, but I said no. He's got another important appointment. In fact, I was just on the phone with the, um, uh, the casting director. I don't know, Gerard. Maybe I'm not cut out for stardom. But you are. What? I hate this. Thank God there's... Uh, thank God there's... There's only a couple more minutes left. Only 11 more minutes. Only 11 more minutes. The 11 minutes are going to be held by 11 minutes. Can I make it through the last 11 minutes without killing myself? Probably not. But hey, let's see. Walt, you can't stop now. You're the talk of the town. This casting director really wants you. Yay! You will be part of a team respected around the world for its um premium content. This part will define premium? your career. Premium content. And not premium content of porno, it's premium content. It's how you'll be remembered. I'm just tired of... I can never do what you claim, and everyone gets disappointed. Not this time. You will not disappoint. You will not disappoint. Boy. You are boy. Oh, Walt, you're up. Tiffany! Tiffany, you promised not to disturb Walt. No, I didn't. Did you visit Coverland? Uh, yeah. Mm, nasty place. Ooh. We're on our way to the Viperwood Hills. Uh, uh huh. But Tiffany wanted to check in on the pig. Thanks. I want to rest now. You guys finish sightseeing, then we'll all go back to the barnyard. I found a bus schedule. Now you're talking. You can't give up now, Walt. I got you the role of a lifetime. What's he got to do? Somersault through an active volcano? While quoting Shakespeare? Probably this movie has, like, no logic. Except when it wants to for some reason. No, no. Walt just has to rap anything he wants. Oh. Alright. I think I have exactly what he's going to rap. enough fuck
Alright, we're back. Once! Hmm. Just do me this one favor, and I'll never ask for anything ever again. I like the Thank sound God. of that. You bugs go sightseeing, and promise not to disturb us until tomorrow. What? <sighs> Good luck, Walt. Oh, we don't have much time. Walt, the place we are going is very cool. Really? Is it going to be Antarctica? Because that's where, because that's where I'd rather be. If it means not watching this shitty ass movie. But here I am, my depressed ass on my chair, watching this fucking movie live with no one watching it. Okay. But hopefully someone would probably watch the replay version. Very cool. Yes, you are. Especially when you wear these. Groovy. I can't see a thing. Walt. Blindness. Blindness. You're styling. But seriously, I, I can't see anything. The price of fashion. Come on. Price of fetched. Come on. <laughs> that audio cut was awful. I think I'll wrap barnyard roots. How did that go? Wherever I go, whatever I do, there's one thing I know. I'm from the barnyard. I'm from the barnyard. Isn't that like a little provincial? Venom, it doesn't matter. Believe me. All right, we're going to, we're going, we're finally going to the slaughterhouse. Finally. Gerardo, Bell, how are you? Wonderful. Let me introduce Walter Pembroke. I've heard so much about you. <laughs> Hi. You look very plump. Huh? <laughs> I, I really can't see with these glasses. Shouldn't I take them off? No. 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 Thank God there's only eight minutes left of this a pile of horseshit. You're great in those shades. That's the image we cultivate. So are we ready? Yup. Good. Just hold still. One thing I know, I'll always be true to my barnyard roots. I'm from the barnyard. Ah, the world is losing some a nice set of pipes. Yeah, but it's gaining some like great sausage links. Hmm. To, to my barnyard roots. I'm from the barnyard. First of all, you don't just grind a pig live. Boy would not like that. Some pigs say, who cares? <laughs> Some pigs say, forget. Okay, I never knew that the meat grinder had fucking eyes and a mouth. What? This pig says, I care. This pig won't regret. I'm from the <laughs> barnyard. I'm from the barnyard. <laughs> Hi. Uh -huh. Sally, the Viper Wood Hills are that way. Walt, wiggle free. Keep rapping, Walt. Tiffany, stop. They like me. Yeah, in a bun with ketchup and fries. Huh? You promise not to interrupt. I only made one promise to Walt's mom that I would protect her baby. And I keep my promises. Stop interfering in Walt's career. Shoo, shoo. No. <laughs> Gilbert, sing that fool! Walt's a pig. Pigs become sausages. Not as long as I am around! <gasps> Again, why is the beef French? I'm French not beef. scared of a bee. French bear versus snack. <laughs> this is for you, Walt! Goodbye, Walt! Alive. 
that is me after I, that is me after watching this fucking movie. <laughs> I am alive. I somehow didn't kill my. I somehow didn't kill myself. <laughs> Walt, stop rapping and start squirming. <gasps> That wasp sting hurts. Uh, I lost steering in my neck, which is a problem because I'm just one long neck. Boss, your phone. What? My phone? Huh? I can't feel it vibrating. How will I know when I get a phone call? Ah! No, no, don't go! Without my phone, I'm finished in this town! Come back! Come back! My stinger did not fall out! I guess that means I am not a bee! Nope, you're a wasp! Yes. Surprised? Not really. I spent a lot of time lying to myself. Is it okay to be a wasp? Of course. You saved the pig's life. <laughs> Thanks, Gilbert and Tiffany and Crystal. Boy, that was scary. I can't believe Gerard told me he needed a performer when all he wanted was sausage links. Walt, when folks start lying, they often don't know when to stop. True. True. Very true. Yeah, which is why it's better not to lie at all. <laughs> That's right. It looks like this trip to Biblewood was worth it after all. Yeah, but now I really want to get back to the barnyard. Good. Yes. Yes. And the second you get there, what are you going to tell your mother? <laughs> that I ate the pie and I broke the pot, and that the dog didn't eat my homework. Good. <laughs> Let's go home. Actually, you guys go ahead. I've got a meeting. What? Tiffany, you're not going home to the barnyard? Not today. But what will I do without you? Baby, you and Tiffany's not going to be around forever, which is why I was so worried about you lying, and why I am so happy you stopped. Oh, you want to know the really good reason never to lie? Yes, yes! Walt, a liar needs a really good memory. Oh. Like, when you said your mother's pie was cherry, you didn't remember that only the pig who ate the pie would know that. <laughs> yeah. But you should tell the truth because it's the right thing to do, not because it's easier than remembering what you said. I understand. Wow, I'm going to miss you. Oh, you'll be seeing plenty of your Tiffany. <clears throat> In any case, we'll just continue to pretend that you are a bee. That is not what I am saying. Hey, Gil. Andre! What's he doing here? Shoo. Shoo. You shoo. Andre's my friend, Wiggles with. You can't be serious. <laughs> yes, I can't. Yes, I can't. <laughs> Thank God there's only two or three minutes left. That's three minutes of... Uh, that'll be three minutes of unending pain. I'm just saying. There goes the neighborhood. Gather round, everybody! Welcome to the new Paddle Wackier, where knowledge is good, fibbing is not. Oh. I'm your host, Tiffany. Our first contestant, Venom. This should be interesting.
Venom, the category is shapes. If you paste two triangles together, what shape do you get? If you don't know, we'll go on to the next question. I do know. Two triangles together is a circle. A circle? Venom, you are tripping and lying. Goodbye. <laughs> When you combine two triangles, you get a diamond. Marvelous. Yes, Tiffany is wonderful. We simply must have her as the guest of honor at this year's cotillion. Yes, absolutely. I like Pavel Wackier much more since Tiffany started hosting. Walt, honey, that I believe. <laughs> oh, Mom. <laughs> Oh, thank God the credits are going. That was 46 minutes of unending pain. If you want me to do it again, then... I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna go hang myself. Not really hang... Well, not hang myself. Actually, I'm not gonna hang with. Fuck, try again. Alright, I'm gonna go drug myself to sleep to try to forget that this ever happened. If you want to watch the stream repeatedly because you just like unending pain, then sure.